Oh gosh, Bridget, 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 she cracks me up. You know what's funny? This Bridget character reminds me of my hair stylist. And so I go to this barber shop, and I guess they're called hair stylists or barbers. No, they're not called barbers. Uh, they're called hair stylists. And it, she, Bridget, looks just like my hair stylist. It's insane. From the nose to the teeth. I know that sounds really crazy and insane. I mean, obviously, my hairstylist doesn't look like a complete troll, but she does look like this character. And the the craziest thing is they share the same personalities. You know, my hairstylist is very nice, uh, very upbeat. The weird thing is she doesn't watch any TV or anything like that. She's not into pop culture, but she's still, you know, her personality is very much like this Bridget character, which is why I was very intrigued with Bridget. Like, I thought, I, I genuinely thought that Bridget was probably my most favorite character in this whole troll thing. So, and I know that's, that's really bizarre to say, but I also love her Cinderella story. Um, I love, I, I just, I love how she got her makeover with her hair. That was hilarious. And her attitude changed when she got her, uh, once she got her outfit and her new hair did. I thought that was funny too. Honestly, this, this whole thing was pretty cool. I really enjoyed watching it. Um, I'll definitely rewatch it again, I think. Just, it put a smile on my face and that's all really that, you'd want when you watch a movie like this um it it does teach kids a, a little bit of a lesson which is happiness is from within uh you don't have to buy it or get it or eat it you could just feel it so ah, such a good movie and i love that song um uh, can't stop the feeling that song is good i play that all the time on, on my phone so anyways Hopefully you guys like the movie.